this project, the initial idea was uh, environmental conservation, and that is more of uh, climate change adaptation. But now, later on, as, a, as an incentive to the farmers around, so we decided we, init we initiated a program where it became a commercialization of the entire thing, which is commercialization of the bamboo. As you know, bamboo is an important product, a tree, and it has uh, various uh, uh, uses in the value chain. So a, go a good example is what Asian tigers have done. Countries like China, they have really invested in production of bamboo so that to expand the cottage industries along the, um, uh, in the, within the economy. So it is actually very useful uh, tree which comes to uh, in our value chain. So uh, investing in this project is of paramount importance. One, it is in line with the directives, with the presidential directives that uh, we need to plant around uh, 15 billion trees. This project has uh, many faces, one of which is uh, climate change adaptation and uh, the second phase of the project is commercialization of the bamboo farming within Narok and Nakuru counties. Uh, currently, as ENSDA, we have approximately 1,400 acres uh, under bamboo within the Mau. And we intend to continuously grow that. Uh, it's part of our project, it's our long-term project. And we are also calling upon our sister agencies in uh, the Environment Ministry to collaborate with us so that we can be able to make this a success. Uh, as a PS has said, we intend very soon to start the cottage industry of this bamboo, but eventually, uh, because you've seen this land is around 10 acres, what our intent or our target was is to put up a bamboo factory. And as you know, bamboo has a lot of uses and we intend to put that into use. Uh, so we are calling upon the government to support this project so that we can have it started. But now with the assurance of the PS and the State Department, we see that that one is going to be 